that JJ had been suicidal on that night. I would do that. Eli told me. Then you know that. She told me. I woke up by 8 o'clock. <laughs> yeah. He was too afraid to be by himself. And you have a guess. And so she stayed the night with him. What? I've been watching this when you went there to talk show and since 8 o'clock in the morning. And you saw him and Gabby yep. together and assumed they were going to make love. Hey, oh, and it's funny. Kind of talk to One, JJ two. and tell him how wrong it was for us to be apart. Partly because you and I had that conversation and you encouraged me to do it. I remember that time. And I went running to when his go in the car. I didn't know what else to do. Uh, our being together would have never happened if we had right. been in our right minds. And I think Mom said that... And then the next morning we found out how who I can wrong I was. To, uh, the, um, garage. What happened to Nas' car? How is JJ now? Better. Oh. Now that Dad and Theo forgave him. Has he forgiven himself? <laughs> Not completely. Not that Theo still can't walk in. Even then, he's still really hard on himself. And knowing that I'm pregnant is wrong. It's brought him back to life. I don't know if he finds out if this baby is not his. I don't know what he'll do. Valerie, I cannot tell him that this baby is Eli's. And neither can you. Did you hear about me leaving the police force? Uh, yeah, I did. Well, I've been thinking of what kind of work I want to get into next, and I haven't come up with much. But, I mean, I'm going to be a dad, so I have to have a job. But I, I saw on the hospital's website a posting about EMT training. I was wondering what you think about it. Well, um, I'm an advisor to the program, and I, I think it's really great. Oh, I, I like it.